have two of the DC Audio 10Ks. Like, you know, people love to, you know, do things with their friends. That's right. So let's build something where you can get in there with your friends and, and have a great time. So C-Pillar build, fourth order band pass, uh, six level five 15s, um, running nice. off those, uh, those two 10Ks. <laughs> What's happening guys? Coming at you from Reno, Nevada this weekend. We are here at the DC Audio Headquarters and I'm about to give you a tour of it. Out front we got Rusty's work truck and we got the base bourbon. They just finished up. I'm going to give you a quick tour of that and also a demo of it as well. It is a beautiful install. I can't wait to show it to you. So stay tuned. I'm going to get right at it. Let's go. All right, so walking up, we got Rusty here from uh, DC Audio. He's the owner and operator of DC Audio. So this is the base bourbon that they just got completed. If you were watching the Facebook live video that I just did, they got really grainy, but you might have seen a good quality uh, walkthrough of this. But anyway, just in case you missed it or didn't get to see it, this is their base bourbon. They've been working on it for, oh, here, I'll let you tell them about it. You know all the details of it. So let them know about the base bourbon, man. So, uh we were working on this for about four months, actually a little over four months, trying to get it done. And uh, so in the back, you can see that we have two of the DC Audio 10Ks. These are our 12 volt amplifiers, um, specifically designed to, you know, to run on standard charging systems. We have a 500 amp hour uh, lithium battery put together. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, some custom machine bars, some base bourbon wrap, on here, Sky High, uh, OFC. Super all cool, gauge. all the details, man. Yes, just the little details, right? That's what makes it all add up. We had these wrapped by Boss Signs in uh, in Reno here to uh, to match the outside. Paneled everything off in just, you know, simple panels. Some, very uh, some clean, vinyl. that's nice though, it's very clean. Tied into the rear air conditioning. The uh, We have a DC grill that will be on there relatively soon. It uh, it yeah, it needs to be finished. <laughs> <laughs> he but, said he had a. Uh, you said you had like a mesh thing on there. It looked yeah, like a so, shower head right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. So that's exactly what it was. I, mean, we, I was so honest. Answer is, is at Home Depot, and I'm like, man, this thing would fit there perfect. <laughs> and somebody even commented, it looks like a shower drain. I'm like, it it's is. Good. <laughs> <laughs> it is a shower yeah, drain. So, that's got to go. <laughs> uh, by the end of today, there will be a DC logo on there that has a mesh background and nice, you know, kind nice. of like a sign, but uh, a lot of air to flow through. And we tied that in, so the Suburbans have rear uh, AC. AC controls. So we tied it into that, so when you're in the front of the vehicle, if you reach up and turn on the overhead air conditioning for your passengers in the back, it actually just cools down the uh, the amplifier section here. Oh, While nice. this is closed down, it'll keep this section cool. The intake board is here, so it truly just pulls it cools in. and cool, yeah. Yeah, all the hot air and blows out air conditioned air. Perfect. Keep everything running cool, so you can. Get That's cool awesome, and you got this thing for twelve hundred bucks. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, this is my twelve hundred dollars <laughs> suburban. The uh, it's funny. I I talked to a, a couple people, and I was like, yeah, I'm looking for another Tahoe, and uh, a guy sent me this Facebook link, and I went to look at it, and I'm like, this isn't even a Tahoe. I should have paid attention, right? He wasn't paying attention to <laughs> Suburban. And uh, the girl's like, just give me 1200 bucks for it. You know, Done. whatever. I'm like, uh, I don't know. And Anna was there and she's like, it's $1,200, just buy it. <laughs> so um, yeah, I got some pictures of it when, it, uh, when we first got it. But, uh, but anyways, yeah, so this thing was 1200 bucks. Awesome. Uh, that's a cool story it's about like my tahoe it's like a two thousand dollar vehicle and yeah <laughs> and, uh, and now it's got well, however many thousands of dollars in audio equipment i don't even want to guess i i right? seen what you just did to it and it's uh <laughs> yeah. it's dumb let's check out the inside let's get off of that all uh right. that sore so, subject of how much money i spent on yeah, tahoe. <laughs> all the money so disregard my bag right here what was it what was important with this build is we wanted something that we could put a lot of people in and you know, like a lot of demo cars, one person fits in it, you're in there by yourself. We're like, you know, people love to, you know, do things with their friends. That's right. So let's build something where you can get in there with your friends and, and have a great time. So C pillar build, fourth order band pass, uh, six level five 15s, 
um, nice. running off those, uh, those two teams. And it gets games. down too, guys. I just uh, got finished listening to it. He actually picked me up from the airport and was beating my brains out on the way. Yeah, that, that was here. fun. So he's got a, uh, what kind of head unit is that? So I got a new Kenwood head unit. Um, stuck the voltage meter in there. Base knob. Base knob there. Simple, clean. Simple nice. And clean. You got the base bourbon mats yeah, down so here. My, my birthday, man, my mom got me these base bourbon <laughs> cool. uh, floor mats. Awesome, man. So I that love was, it. That was really cool. Very cool. So under, in order to have a huge system like that, you have to have the proper electrical for it. You do. So what you got going up under the hood right here? All right, so to, so to power all of this, we have um, two Mechman alternators that Matt over there built for us. Beautiful. Um, and they're they're 320 amp alternators. 99% sure that's what I got. <laughs> <laughs> this is the same exact. Uh, I use McMahon alternators on my vehicle too, and it's, uh, they do super well. So I'm no doubt that he'll have great luck out of these for sure. Yeah, love the chrome finish too. Yeah, yeah. He was Very telling nice. me I was gonna get uh, the same ones that are on the Astro. Just leave that that uh, you know the the, the black ones. Mm -hmm. And uh, he was telling me he had these chrome cases, and I was like. I like Chrome. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Put him on there. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was going to get him to um, do the demo later. I was just going to do a walk by this, but since we've already went through the entire vehicle, do you want to go ahead and back it over there and show the people what it'll do? Yeah. Or we can do it right here if you it want to. It don't matter to. to me. All right. Let's we do it. We just wanted to get on in. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm going to sit back here in the back like I was when I got picked up from the airport <laughs> this is exactly what happened i just got into the seat right here and he let me have it <laughs> yeah man all right let me flip this around and then i got so this track um you know dj magic mike is so <laughs> yeah you know uh it's funny this this got me like the first time i think i heard bass was a dj magic mike uh cassette because i'm old <laughs> uh so and and that's what got me hooked and like i i was always the guy to you know waiting for something new to come out from this guy and it's it's been amazing that like you know through my childhood or growing up or whatever you know i, I bought all these things mm -hmm. and then uh later on in life you know never would have thought at some point i would connect with this guy and this guy would make me you know a, a, a dc audio bass track that's awesome so it's uh that's what we're gonna listen to Let's and do it. uh i smile every time i do because it's just like one of those things that you never think will happen to you but yeah but yeah. it does <laughs>
That's so awesome, dude. Look, this this, this thing, your, uh... look, this thing is heavy. It was spinning these things around in circles. Yeah, it is. I was watching the zipper uh, get yeah, there, man. all kinds of stuff happening. That is awesome. We're gonna <laughs> hop out real quick and let you play it one time so I can get a little bit of flex on the outside yeah. for them. They like seeing the flex, so let it rip again. So awesome. was that guys give this video a big huge like <laughs> share it share give it. us a yeah give us a comment below let us know what you think about it this is rusty's base bourbon right here super awesome man everybody likes it oh hell yeah i already know they are man i loved it <laughs> all right we'll see y'all in the tour video next